Yeah. I find that a lot of times players get so hung up on build orders and unit compositions that they don't really give any thought to just good sound tactics, you know, good strategy. Uh, things like not moving through the middle of a map when it's super open and covered in creep. Yeah, if I get to the choke point now, then this base is dead for sure. I think he lost more gas than I did. Yeah. But I was a bit careless, so I should have uh, kept the class eye a bit closer here. Yeah. He hung in there really well for this being as behind as he was. Yeah, I agree. I mean, if you don't build roaches and hydras for 40 minutes, and yeah. Zerg units can actually be quite good. got time for one more game before we take some questions from uh, our our audience yeah sure all right you sure you don't want to try try and play a game yourself <laughs> would you like to coach me through one I don't know how, how bad it's gonna be it'll be bad <laughs> it'll be bad I, I'll go I, I'll jump up I'll give it a go okay all right just do what I tell you to you'll be fine <laughs> so I'm going to be playing Protoss against Spinny This is uh, all right. So you got to give me the most Protoss favored map in the world. What's the most Toss favored map imaginable? Um, you could host the NASL Crevasse. <laughs> okay, that's what I'll do. <laughs> NASL Crevasse. All right, so I'll invite you into the game, and you're going to see my bronze level Protoss. This is going to yeah. Be how many Protoss games did you play? I've played maybe fifty. Do you know how you want to set up your hotkeys? Uh, I want to put my army on one and my sentries on two. And um, uh, <laughs> no, <laughs> I don't know. You can do that. <laughs> that that was such a that was such a like a a sound of disdain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't think that'd be a good idea. <laughs> uh, maybe keep your every, your colossi on two, or I uh, just keep everything on one. I think you. All right, everything you're on one. Better off with that. Okay. Everything on one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Focus on building the right things at the right time. All right, that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> I should have brought in an easier Zerg opponent. Maybe you should have. 
I got Idra. Go. <laughs> oh. uh, I'm not laughing. It's not funny. Okay. I actually like Greg a lot. He's a great guy. Yeah, he is. He gets a bad rap. You have not enough minerals. Sometimes. So do you do that probe doubling? Uh, I will. As soon as they start popping out. Okay. Alright. First probe. Okay, now I'll send you probe to a choke. Around about 50 or 60 minerals. That's not your choke. I knew that. Choke is to the right. <laughs> Build it not directly, but a bit behind. So it is in range. Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> Yeah, you know, probe, probe, probe. Always keep building probes. Anyone is scout, Yeah, that's right. I start chrono boosting probes after the pylon finishes. As soon as the pylon finishes, yeah. Then we're gonna go for 13. That's a bit too early. We're gonna go for a 13 gateway at the choke and the gas afterwards. Do a chrono boost immediately after the first one finishes. Yeah. See if I can create some sort of a wall in. We just get a gas now, right? We're gonna we wanna go for a one gate expansion. Okay. Since this is pretty pretty safe map to expand with the small ramp. I'll expand to the back. Right. And the thing is, since uh, the back has two gas here, it's uh, only a one force field ram, and the third is blocked by rap, uh, by by rock. Build a pylon anywhere quickly. This is a pretty good map for BBZ. So okay. like the last scout. So yeah, and send a probe to your choke to build the cyber core. Okay, we just finished. Make a zealot. And uh, yeah, do that. You build a core anywhere. Usually you want it to be in your wall in, but it seems to be a bit of a problem. <clears throat> okay, second gas. Oh, what a jerk. No, n never mind that. We'll just get the, the Nexus up faster then. Need another pile. Sentry? Um, yeah, as soon as you, you want to go for sentries. Check if he has gas or not. Build another probe. No gas. And you always want the warp gate research. One gas. You can check the, the gas count, how much he's mined. Because that would have told you round about when he got his gas. You can build an Nexus, you got 400. And. Yeah. Build the Nexus. I'd be a bit scared about sending the Zelt back there like that. Since now Zerkling is gonna just run to the front. To prevent that from happening, maybe you can send out a scouting probe now. So that in case many Zerklings come in. You can you can react in time. You want another sentry, and now get us. Yeah, get another gate. We just just keep spending your minerals on anything. Oh, that's a bummer. Yeah, force we might have been worth it to prevent the scout, but it's not such a big deal. Going to move to Nexus, get a second gas, and we want to go for a Stargate with our 150 gas. Maps like Metalopolis or Xonaga would feel a bit unsafe going for the Stargate. But on this map, yeah, why not get one? He's not going to be able to kill us anytime soon. Our queens. Use your second gas, get the other simulators and slide. Do you want to go for Colossi or a gateway unit push after the Stargate opening? Alright. Am I going to continue pumping sentries or am I good with two? 
just build sentries and probes. We need to be going for for Mel's gateway plus the push. Or go for more late game oriented with robotics. So what do you want to do? I'm gonna get go get a Phoenix. Uh, Void Ray, Phoenix, Phoenix, because I like that. Okay. Movement. And you always want to be chrono boosting your Stargate. You also need another pylon because otherwise you're gonna be back too. No matter what you do, you either need to get a robotics or some gateways, or preferably both. Right now? Yeah. If you, you to base or start mining, you could slide some probes from the main to the natural, because natural is very undersaturated. You don't want to have many above 16 workers on any patch. I guess you know that from Zerg as well. Yep. And the instant your border arrives, you should send him out to scout. Right. Chrono boost the following Phoenix. You always want to want to use the Chrono boost on the tech production buildings. The yeah, gateway can can be can be transformed. And what we should be thinking about now is: is he taking a third? When am I taking my third? That should be the, the main focal points. You could have a random expansion somewhere on the map. So as soon as you're sure, retrieve the void ray. As soon as you're sure that you won't be able to do any damage with your air, you can send your air units to scatter around the map. Yeah, there's three queens already. Um, stop trying the void ray errors, get a Colossus pay, and scout for any hidden random expansion since the third one isn't up at the normal phase right now. Also, move up with the units a bit and spam a lot of pylons since you're getting supply block big time. Uh, I just heard a Nidus. Well, is it somewhere uh, in your base? It's in his fourth. He's probably got queens popping out there right now. Yeah, maybe you can snap the Nidus before any of them come out. <laughs> Indeed, I told you to spam pilots, didn't I? Just build like six. I know it's not as easy as holding down the V button, but. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a little harder. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so these spores are gonna finish. Yeah, just repeat. Wow, that is a lot of queens. Alright. Oh my god, <laughs> sock, my macro is so bad. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is happening? <laughs> yeah, and people are always complaining about Zerg macros so hard. The reality is you only gotta you only need one button for macro. That's it. Um yeah, build an axis, build a second robo, build a robo bay and just keep warping. Do you have your gateways on the hotkey? Yeah. Yeah you do. Just keep warping lots of stalkers, get some cans at your third. Yeah, keep moment. warping units at your third. Keep walking stalkers. <laughs> this is so bad. The main, main problem I see right now is that we don't know how much he has. Maybe you can use the Phoenix to, to keep a tab on his production and scout and stuff. Or, yeah, maybe deal with Zero Phoenix first. Not only drop uh, Nidusing us to to Harris, but also wants to keep us busy to do something. So yeah, 
I want to get an army out ASAP and then at least scare him a bit. I do not deny this at your third, at your, at your ne 